hi guys in this video i'm going to show you how to install a windows xp or windows 7 or windows 8 or Win even windows 10 in your android phone so that you can run a android operating system at the same time you can run a windows operating system uh, in your phone uh, first of all go to your play store i've mirrored uh, my android phone onto my computer so go to android and search for limbo limbo pc emulator I've already done that uh, and I've, uh, I've already installed so after installing you can open limbo so that it can write some files into your uh, android phone so after you do that um you go back go back home um i've already downloaded a xp operating system and saved it in my sd card so when i go down in my android phone you see that uh, I have an XP image, ISO image, there at the bottom, there it is, I have an XP operating system, I've decided to do an XP because uh, it's a bit lighter, it's 352 MB, um, Windows 10 is a bit bigger in size, uh, Windows 8 is bigger in size, so I decided to do XP for this demonstration because it, it also takes a shorter time, so as you can see now I know where my image is my xp images i'll go back and go back to my limbo that i've already installed i've provided links below in the description where you can download images for windows xp windows 7 windows 10 or any operating system you want even um, linux even ubuntu if you want to install them in your android phone uh, keep in mind that this one does not replace your Android operating system. All you are doing is that you are just installing an XP. It's going to run uh, concurrently with your Android operating system. It's just like installing a virtual machine in your Android phone. So first, I'm going to go there at where you see none and tap on new. So because I'm doing an XP, I'll just call this machine XP then tap on create so when you click here you are going to see different operating systems you see you'll see free doors you'll see calypso you'll see dsl dsl linux you'll see debian linux so because we are not doing linux i'm just going to tap at the side there so that it closes this uh, that window so for architecture we are going to use um, that two bits so just make sure you use that uh, times 86 that is 32 bits because uh, 64 bit is a bit unstable for this so for machine type just leave it as it is pc and then for cpu model we are going to use kemu 32 kemu 32 make sure you use that one kemu 32 cpu cores just leave it as it is uh, that is one for ram in MB, I'm going to go with 512. I'm going to go with 512 size of RAM or even a bit higher, let's say 616 MB. And then I'm going to scroll. Now I'm going to select this first a disk. As you can see, it has already given me an option, but I'm going to leave that one as it is first so that we go down and set some things. For graphic display, just leave it at standard and then you scroll down, everything there, leave it as it is, leave everything there as it is. So for orientation, I'm going to select um, landscape, I'm going to select landscape so that it will be a bit um, easy to, to see all the process and all. So after doing that, I'll go back up there at the. Sorry, I changed the little I'll go up there where we have the storage, and then I'll tap on that arrow, and then go to open. 
and then it will open for me my SD card. If it doesn't open for you your SD card, uh, you are just going to locate it. So I'm going to scroll down to where I, I uh, had saved my XP, my XP image, there it is, tap on it and it's going to save it there. Then I'm going to scroll up and tap on start. So it has already started, it's changing the orientation to, it's changing the orientation landscape as you can see it's loading it's loading our XP operating system there it is Windows XP professional as you can see I'm installing a Windows operating system in my Android phone it is not going to replace your Android operating system, but it's just going to run in a virtual environment. So you can continue using your Android phone. At the same time, you can continue using uh, XP operating system, you, uh, Windows operating system, sorry. You can use uh, Windows XP, Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 10. So we're just going to wait for it to load, it's installing. You just follow the normal process of installing Windows and after it finishes installing uh, you are going to set it up as you wish just like your desktop operating system so depending with the speed of your of your Android phone it will it can either take a long time or a shorter time installing uh, the operating system as you can see mine is already already almost through still loading so it's done installing and now it's configuring the computer for the first use keep in mind that this is my android phone i've just mirrored my android phone on my computer this is my android phone i've mirrored it in uh, on my computer so that uh, i can demonstrate it uh, well so guys this is how you are going to this is how you can install a windows operating system on your android phone as a part of your android phone operating system you are going to run both uh, android and windows operating system in your phone but the primary operating system is your android uh, operating system this uh, this this operating system a windows operating system is just there on a virtual machine so the primary operating system i insist is still android it does not replace your android operating system until the next video where we are going to look on how we are going to look at how to mirror your android device on your uh, computer screen like just the way i've done mine this is my android phone and this is my computer in the next video we are going to focus on how to mirror your android phone on your computer screen until the next video don't forget to subscribe cheers